No one is immune from colon cancer. We anticipate in the United States this year 150,000 new diagnoses of colon cancer, and there will be 50,000 people that will die from colon cancer this a year in the United States. Practicing what I preach, I came in to have a colonoscopy done, and lo and behold, in the recovery area, following the procedure, I woke up and uh, Dr. Guyton said, well, we need to do a little surgery, and I was shocked. Uh, I'd had no symptoms, no pain, no discomfort. Uh, I'd had laboratory tests done uh, several months prior to that. All of my blood work was normal. I was not anemic. Uh, so I didn't have the procedure done because I was feeling bad or because I was having any difficulties. Uh, I was simply following and practicing what I preached to my patients. Well, not being screened is the most common mistake. Uh, a recent article came out in the New England Journal of Medicine that for a fact now shows statistically a dramatic reduction in colon cancer deaths in the United States. And it's attributed to one thing and one thing only, screening. Medical center um, personnel, as a part of their insurance package, has screening colonoscopy as a part of their package. And lo and behold, why not take advantage of something that could save your life? Those individuals who have average risk would be beginning at age 50 for Caucasians, age 45 for African Americans, and they should have screening colonoscopy at those ages, and then every 10 years thereafter now, if polyps are found in those individuals on the initial screening, then a follow-up colonoscopy will be done in either three to five years. If there's a family history, then we recommend screening, if you take the age of the first degree relative and subtract 10 years, then that individual should have a colonoscopy at that time. It is life-changing. You know, I, you know, I used to be sympathetic with patients when they have a bad diagnosis. I can be empathetic now. I've been on the operating table. I've experienced the, the NG2. Uh, I've experienced uh, the care of uh, the uh, wonderful staff at the hospital. And a special kudos to that staff and how great they treated me and how fortunate we are in this community to have a medical center that we have. Well, I think the most important thing in regards to colon health is, is the, the change in your lifestyle. Avoid the things that we know that increase your risk. Being overweight, sitting in front of the computer all the time and not getting exercise, proper diet, exercise, all of those things are critically important in the prevention of colon uh, problems and colon health. But when I was growing up, Smokey the Bear and the National Park Service had this ad that said, only you can prevent forest fires. And my challenge to the medical staff employees is, only you can prevent colon cancer. You get your screening colonoscopy. For more information or to schedule your colonoscopy screening, contact the Digestive Health Specialist at 680-5565.